Well, from first call to end of watch. Curtis Ming is going to walk us through the tragic moments. Wednesday, 11.43 a.m., police get a call about a disturbance between a man and a woman inside a North Sacramento home. Officers later meeting her at a separate location, a home in the Arden Arcade area. At 5.41 p.m., officers respond to the original home on Redwood Avenue on standby as the woman gathered some things. About 30 minutes later at 6.10. Multiple shots fired, multiple shots fired. An officer is hit. The suspect reportedly firing from the front and the back of the home as an officer is down in a yard. High powered rifle, multiple reloads. He's still firing. A barrage of bullets making it tough to get her medical aid. I do not believe a rescue can be accomplished yet until we lock down where he's at. It took around 45 minutes for an armored vehicle to show up at 654. We're going to try to do an officer rescue. <laughs> At 6.59, Officer Tara O'Sullivan is raced to the UC Davis Medical Center. Confirming, uh, we have our officer out. Charles 88, we're with the officer en route to UC Davis. Let him know we're en route. The injury is left armpit, left forearm, weak pulse. A growing parade of colleagues comforting one another for hours outside the emergency room. At 12.30 a.m., Sacramento police hold a news conference, a stripe already over their badges. I'm sad to share with you tonight that we lost our, one of our own. Officer Tara Christina O'Sullivan died at the hospital. 1.54 a.m., suspect Adele Ramos surrenders.